Welcome to uh, Something Else, episode number 62 with my good self, Somnium. I hope a very messy new year was had by one and all and that you're smashing the poop out of 2018 already. We're firing on all cylinders here with cracking music from our good mates Free Jack, Damon Hess, Greg Stainer, Scott Forshaw and loads more. Uh, we've got all the news you didn't need in Something going on and we catch up with Gorp in uh, Say Something. However, we kick off uh, the first show of the year with the first track. It is Paul Spencer with Stay With Me.
Drop it to the floor, to the floor, drop it to the floor, to the floor, drop it to the floor, drop it to the floor, to the floor, drop it to the floor, to the floor, drop it to the floor, to the floor, drop it to the floor. featuring Coral with Drop It to the Floor. That's the Elliot K remix. And up next, it's our good friends, or my good friends, uh, I'm sure a lot of people's good friends, Scott Forshaw and Greg Stainer teaming up featuring Stephen Lamar with Minds Made Up. You're on me, Somnium, and this is Something Else. My mind's made up I don't feel the same anymore We tried to make it work too many times before We used to touch Feelings that we just can't ignore Come closer One last time
Big Confused with Shaka Khan. This is Shaka Ken with uh, Rebirth of Dick. Uh, sounds rude, but I think they mean Richard. Uh, Kenny Summit's Native Tongues mix there. And then up next, another good friend. Well, it's a friend of the show show. Um, it is Damon Hess with On The Block. You all meet Somnium and this is something else. catch up with someone in this. Say something. This week, we welcome a DJ and producer who has been about under many different pseudonyms for quite some time. He's had tracks out on Elro, Dirty Bird, plus loads more. He's one talented chappy from Scarborough and is uh, known as Oliver Portamento to his mum. Please welcome to Say Something. It is Gorp. Hello, Gorp. How are you? And what are you up to? Hi, David. I'm um, very well, thanks. I'm just currently in Leeds, um, just uh, in the studio, just working on a few bits. Looking forward to the gigs I've got coming up. Later in the year, I'm playing in San Francisco, Detroit. That's if my visa goes through. Lots and lots of other things, keeping myself busy. Excellent. Well, you are from Leeds. There is a good chance your visa won't go through, I reckon. OK, well, so that we know you a little bit better, can I ask you some random questions? Fire away. What is the part of a person or a lady that you gawp at the most? Um, yeah, no, I think um, I, I like a girl with nice eyes or nice ankles. Not what? Well, oh, come on, not none of the bits in between. What's wrong with you, man? You're either looking at the floor or looking up at the sky. <laughs> Oh, okay. Well, I'm not going. I was hoping to get something smutty out of you, but it doesn't think you're not going to lower yourself to my level. Not at the moment. <laughs> okay, fair enough. Maybe later. I'll give you a couple of beers. Um, okay. Have you got uh, a regret in life? If so, what is it? The only thing I regret was um, shaving my hair off at school when I was about 14 or 15. I had an undercut wedge. Well, it was a wedge, and it went down, <laughs> down uh, to my shoulders. And one day, I was eating my cocoa pops, and it got in my mouth. And uh, I thought, do you know what? I'm sick of this hair. 
So I went up the up to the top of the garden and I shaved it off. And uh, yeah, my mum thought it was a dead animal, but it was actually my hair at the end of the garden. And uh, that's the only thing I regret because now I'm bald and um, I'd love to have that, that long, greasy hair again. And uh, and when you, I mean, you went up to the top of the garden to shave it off. What did you use, a Flymo? <laughs> no, it was um, a, a Remington uh, shaver, which, uh, which, yeah, I thought if I went up the garden, I wouldn't have to sweep it up, you see. So. <laughs> I like your thinking, I like your thinking. Okay, next question. It's, uh, it's a classic question. I've used it before, but uh, it's a goodie. What is the worst date that you've ever been on? The worst date? I went on a bit of a spree about two years ago when I first moved to Leeds. Yeah, I joined the uh, the Tinder generation. One that I remember, I went to meet a girl. We went just for a drink and everything, and we got chatting, and I thought, oh, she seems she seems quite normal. And then um, she said to me, she um, just got back from Thailand with her ex-boyfriend, and she'd been watching a Ladyboy show. Um, and then she ended up staying with one of the lady boys for a week and then she said to me would I like to go back to her house to shoot air rifles up a garden out of a shed is that a euphemism for something else though shooting air rifles up a garden at a shed that could be that could mean something else over there uh, you never know you never know but yeah no it's so interesting and so bizarre but yeah no it's it, it definitely led me to know what i wanted in a girl anyway yeah i can imagine and not air rifles garden sheds and uh, and lady boys yes okay and the final question uh, it's a quick one cheese and wine or pints and jelly deals uh, cheese and wine cheese and wine oh you're, you're a classy northerner i like it well thank you very much uh, oliver porto mento or mr gorp uh, as he likes to be known uh, now, before you go, do please leave us with a track that you'd like to play, everyone. I'm going to leave you with uh, one I've just finished. So it's Gorp and Jimbo's Rerub. It's of a classic Basement Jacks track, Red Alert. So I hope you enjoy it. It's a premiere and no one's heard it apart from you. Say something. Say something.
Cusack's this week's guest, Gorp, for joining us. That was a cheeky little remix by him. It is uh, Basement Jack's Red Alert, the Gorp and Gimbo Rerub. Nice. Up next, we've got Deep Track and Paul Hardcastle Jr. with Addicted, featuring Raph. It's the Rio Della Duna remix. You're with Somnium, and they're on something else.
Take My Heart and then up next Toe Talk with On My Way the Selecchio in the house mix you me so me and this is something else I know they say if you play with fire you're only gonna get yourself burned but I like how it feels when it's close to me I guess I'll never learn
Gravel Pit, another good friend of the show, remixing that one. It is a free jack dub there. Up next, all the news you didn't need in this. Something going on. Badu, the dating app, just made it way easier to find your club crush. If you're in a, a multi-room club like Fabric that holds thousands of people, you can now use the dating app Badu's new people nearby function to see a list of everyone within the very near vicinity. Uh, so it's now even easier to regret picking up that sweating, gurning monster raver than ever before. 
2017's most dangerous songs while driving list has been revealed. I wasn't aware there was a 2016's, but anyway, I digress. And in at number one, it really is Stormzy with uh, the track Big For Your Boots. Uh, the analysis is based on tempo and beat. So weirdly, Ed Sheeran also features twice in the top ten. I can only think it must be his ginger hair. More than a thousand people attended the 12-hour rave uh, in Wales somewhere. I don't know, then I can't pronounce the name, so I'm not even going to try to be, be offensive. Despite the disruption and an arrest, a number of attendees headed back to clean up the site on January the 2nd. Isn't that nice? Especially with a hangover, it can't be nice. It's probably raining as well. Local resident Jesse Jones, of course he was called that, uh, commented in the uh, video that you made, for all the people moaning, they're clearing everything up and that he can't fault them. Well, he said it like that, but with a Welsh accent and a bit more spit. Last night the DJ 
always like to end the show with three in a row, and today is no different. We had a uh, kicking off the three, no method with Let Me Go, the Scott Fortier and Greg Stainer remix featuring for the second time in this show. They must be some talented chappies. Then up next after that, we had Michael Prado with Last Night a DJ Saved My Life, the Ada or Ada extended mix. And then this in the background, Juno Lark and Eric Murillo featuring Aura Solar with a track called Bad Girl. Yeah, have been listening to me, Somnium, and if you want to get in contact, as always, and you can send me tracks as well to include in the show, um, you can email me, somnium at gmail.com, S-O-M-N 3-U-M. You can also get the show again, the full track listing on iTunes, just uh, just search me. You'll find it. You're clever people. I'm sure you'll do fine. Well, I'll see you at the same time, same place next week. I've been Somnium. This has been Something Else. See ya. Something Else.